Hey everyone, Technomancer here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to activate the eSIM on your iPhone Air in a few ways. So let's get started. Now, one way is by first going into your setting and then you're going to go to cellular. Now, if you don't have anything set up here, it's going to be really straight and simple. Uh, as long as you're connected to Wi Fi, you can go ahead and click on Setup Cellular. Now, once you click on Setup Cellular, you have a couple options here. You can transfer from a nearby iPhone if you already have an existing phone with service that you want to move over. You can use a QR code which your company will provide or the carrier that you have. And then you can also do the same thing on an Android phone. So just follow the prompt. For example, if you have an iPhone nearby, like this one I have here, when I click on that, it'll prompt me, as long as you unlock it, prompt me to continue to transfer my number. So I'll hit continue and follow the prompt. It will move that eSIM from my old phone to my new phone. Really simple, straightforward, as long as the old phone is running iOS 16 or later. Now, let's say you didn't have that, you're setting up very first time with a QR code. What you'll do is set QR code by using, usually your carrier will give you the QR code and instructions, and you can scan the QR code. The QR code is gonna look something like this. If you have it on another device, you just go ahead and scan it, and it will detect that and it'll add that info here. This QR code isn't valid, that's why I'm getting this message, but you'll do the same thing. Now, another way you can do it is if you get it on this phone as an email, what you can do is long press and hold on the QR code. You should see an option that says add eSIM, basically. It will, the iPhone will automatically detect your eSIM, uh, basically code by you long pressing and holding. So if you long press and hold with your fingers, you'll see an option that pops up that says add eSIM and it automatically configure the eSIM for you. So those are different ways to configure the eSIM or activate it on your iPhone Air. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider hitting the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.